Hey everyone, I am on spring break and instead of going on some fancy fun trip, I decided to blow my money on things. I went to Target and I went to Kohl's and Walmart. So I decided to do a quick little haul video of the crap I got. So stuff. Stuff. Um, I'll start with Walmart because I was one thing it's these, which are like, well, what are those? The ultimate silicone gel petals with the travel case for a smooth look with or without your bra. And they're just um, for your nips. Because I've, I've been really trying to not wear my bra so much lately. And like, a reason why I have to wear a bra is because like, my nips are like popping out everywhere. So it's just these suckers. So we'll see how that goes. They feel real nice. So if you guys want me to do like a review kind of on these, um, I totally will. It's by Lingerie Solutions. So I'll totally do a review or something if you guys want me to on these. Just because I've been just trying to my bra less. So there she be. Next I will do Target. Um, I will do... I bought, I bought basically the same stuff in Target. I'm just different-ish, except for this. This is the biggest different thing ever. It is these, these, this candle from Archaeology Number no. Five or Number no. Five Archaeology. I don't know. It's an Urban Number no. Five grapefruit and lemongrass. This was originally fifteen dollars, and I paid like four fifty for it, which is awesome. It smells really good. It's black wax, black wick, black matte, thisness, and I think it smells really good, sweet and clean. So I got that. And it's big. It's 16 ounces or 453 grams. And looks cool. Like that. The other stuff I bought, um, mainly socks and tights. So, mainly tights. <laughs> but I'll show you my socks first. I got this pair. It is like a, what color is this? Like a like radiant orchid <laughs> color with navy stripes and what uh, walruses on them. And this was 75 cents. All my stuff was on clearance. BT dubs. I got these two pairs of socks, which are like the same socks, just different colors. These are both 90 cents. This is like periwinkle, navy, and like a white silvery sparkle bit on parts of it. And then this one is burgundy and like a deep plum with gold. Next, I'll do these two because these I'm really excited for. I got these. I keep saying these, this pair of fleece lined leggings, this, uh, these were $3.60, they're really shiny, they reminded me of like disco pants, so I thought maybe that's how I'd wear them, so there's that. The other thing, if you know me, I've been looking for velvet like high and low, but there's not a lot of velvet like ever, but I finally found some velvet leggings and they were also $3.60. I bought a ton of tights. I got this pair, which is like a, it's black and silvery, sparkly, like fishnet-esque tights. And these were $2.40. But these tights, which are like a ribbed tight and they're fleece lined. And these were $3. Um, I have one pair of fleece lined tights. So having another pair is always good. And they're like ribbed-ish. Ribbed-ish. And then two pairs of crazy-ish tights. There's this pair which is stripey and this is $2.40. See the picture? And there's this pair which is stripes and polka dots and this was also $2.40. Then some stuff that people may not care about. Underpants. I got this pair of white and burgundy star underpants with a little bow on it. And this was $1.50. They're cute. These two remind me of like the sp of sportiness, even though I'm not sporty. They remind me of sports in like kind of like the 70s or 60s. Like I should be like at a roller rink or something. So this is black and white and it was $1.50. I really just like this part of it all. I'm a big fan of bands on underwear. And this pair reminds me of toothpaste because it's teal and red orange. So I'm just like, mm, toothpaste. And this is also $1.50. I'm just concerned because they're white. So these are going to be ugly real fast. I just, I just know it. That's all I got from Target. 
So last thing I'm going to place, I guess, is Kohl's. I had a gift card to Kohl's, so I thought I should just use it all up. So I used it all plus some. So, you know. I have this really rad skirt. It is red and lacy and real cute. It, go, it hits me about the knee, and I'm 5'8". And this was originally $48, and I paid $480 for it. It's really cute, and it's from Elle, by the way. Yeah. I love this skirt. This is probably, like, one of my favorite things that I got. I love it so much. Um, I'll save this for last. Another skirt I got from Elle is this one. It's black and has, like, shiny polka dotty bits on it. It's really poofy, like it poofs out a lot. And this is about a size or two bigger than what I normally wear, but it's fine because it still fits real well. And this was also by L, if I didn't say that already. This was $5.40. You can tell I am a clearance junkie. There's stuff in clearance. I will buy it. The, uh, the last three things I have are from the men's wear area. I got this shirt from Craft and Borrow, and it was $4.80. It's black crew neck. And the way that this looks, it, okay, maybe you won't be able to see it. It's, like, exactly like these tights. So I'm like, I could wear these together, and it'd be matchy-matchy. Um, maybe, oh, we can't see it on the black, but maybe I'll show you on the other one. Which I got. This one, though, is a v-neck. Also menswear, also $4.80. Maybe you can tell better on this one. Can you? A little bit? Maybe? But it's like the same exact look at, as these tights. <clears throat> I'm really good at this whole showing thing, but... The last thing, which is the biggest thing and the most expensive thing, is this jacket. I say I almost cropped apart. This is from the brand Helix, I guess? Anyways, it is like a varsity jacket. I don't like sports, but I like sports-inspired clothes. I'm weird. Also, men's section, it is fabric and pleather sleeves with, um, what's the word I'm looking for? <laughs> I can't think of the word. It has the hood, like a sweatshirt hood, and it's like a quilted business up inside. I forget, I didn't even notice if it has pockets or not. Oh, thank God. It has real pockets, which are pleather lined. And it has buttons and zips and all of that goodness. I'm really excited about this. It is, I mean, okay, it snowed yesterday, but it's technically spring. And so I thought this would be a good spring jacket. It looks cute. It's comfortable. I feel like it's pretty warm. Um, It is shorter than the jacket I'm currently using. But I would totally use it like normal. It's a real good fit. I really dig it. So that's it. Oh, did I see the price on this? It was $17. So it was hella expensive, but oh, instinct is a virtue. But I really like it. And I feel like I would get a lot of use out of it, especially since spring is here, technically, even if... It might snow again, who knows, but I mean, it's got a hood. That's helpful. That's ready for Wisconsin spring. Plus, like, I can bring this on planes and such, and it'll be a good layering piece, I want to say. But yeah, I spent a lot of money. But this is like, I've had that gift card since Christmas, so I didn't use it at all, so I thought it was good. Those two skirts are more professional since I am graduating in May, and then I have a good, like, outdoor, like an outerwear piece, and two good casual basics. And the underwear, everyone needs underwear, and I needed to replace some of my funky tights, because a lot of them are getting holes in them since I wear them so often. I don't like wearing pants that often. Anyways, <laughs> that's all. If you guys have bought anything recently from Target, or Kohl's, or even Walmart, um, especially clearance, because I'm a clearance junkie. Please let me know in the comments below. If you like this video, please thumbs it up. 
and subscribe to me if you would like to see more of me and keep up to date. If you want to see me off of YouTube, follow me on Instagram. Yeah, or add me on Snapchat, that's a thing. Um, I'm kind of boring day to day, but still an option. I'll link all of that stuff down below for you. And that's all I got. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!